Jennifer Lopez was on a mission in Los Angeles on June 10 when she was spotted furniture shopping with her 15-year-old son Max. You're welcome to Stats In. If you're just joining us please subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to turn on notifications bell for more videos. The actress looked stylish in an orange and white oversized dress. She paired the look with sky-high heels and a sleek bun. Her son looked casual in green pants and a graphic t-shirt, with a baseball cap hiding his face. Photos showed the mother and son duo entering and leave a furniture store in law. It wasn't clear if Jlo purchased anything during the shopping spree but she has a good reason to be on the hunt for new furniture. The actress recently made headlines alongside her husband Ben Affleck for buying a $60 million mansion after nearly two years of house hunting. The mansion is known as the Wallingford Estate and is in the heart of Beverly Hills. Sitting on two acres of land, the home comes with thousands of square feet of living space, including 12 bedrooms and 24 bathrooms which is perfect for their blended family. However, the mansion has a dark history. Over the years, several of its owners were arrested for criminal activities. For example, in 2004, it was bought by Curtis Somoza only a few years before he was handed 25 years in jail for orchestrating a $64 million Ponzi scheme. Later, the estate was picked up by Saudi Prince Majd Abdulaziz Al Saud in 2015. However, the prince was soon involved in a scandal when a woman accused him of assault. Though he was arrested, police couldn't prosecute the royal due to lack of evidence. The home went on to be purchased by real estate developed Gayla Asher, who focused on renovating the property before Jlo and Ben scooped it up. Jennifer's real estate purchase isn't the only reason she's been in the headlines this month. The actress recently made a candid confession about how difficult it was to film an intimate scene with Jason Statham. During her decades-long career, Jlo has had to get close with a variety of co-stars for the sake of her movies, but it appears that filming 2013's Parker was one of the most challenging for her. My heart was beating out of my chest Jlo recalled, it was awful, you can hear a pin drop, and everybody knows the scene is coming, it was really nerve-wracking, the actress said the worst part was not knowing what to expect during the moment. While she wasn't required to undress completely, Jen explained that it was enough to make me feel uncomfortable. Okay that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Please like, share and subscribe for more.